Every day is a school day, as you say. You know, you're always learning. I love to see a project from the start, from just a pencil drawing to an actual full-fledged finished product. We can speak to somebody in Brazil one morning, Japan the next day. Brilliant job, good money, good hours, good fun. Forsyth started in 1890, specialising in the distillation industry initially and then diversifying into paper, now most recently into oil and gas and we're looking into nuclear. I've got two sort of roles here, design engineering role and I've got a project management role. When the project comes in at the, the purchase order stage, we take it from there right through to completion. But everything that we deliver from here at the end of the day, you've got to be happy with before you allow it to go out the door. You can look at the various distilleries and say, I made that. It may last for a few years, it may last for 50 years, but it's very unique to Scotland. Something that makes you proud. My name is Gary Garrick and I'm a coppersmith. It entails the fabrication of copper, pot stills. I do like going away, installing new stills at home and abroad. I've been over to Texas and Barbados. Day to day, my job usually consists of managing a project from start to finish, so ordering material or planning the schedule. I interact with clients, suppliers and other departments. The effort I put in I can see throughout the project, so it translates all the way through. And getting to see a project all the way through and it going well means that I did my job well. My name's John Stewart, I'm the Managing Director. I just like making things. We're quite proud of the one we're working on just now, the peat furnace. It's been quite a challenge to get that up and going. The biggest challenge is making sure work is carried out safely. My name's Mike Stewart. I'm responsible for production management here. Organise jobs and materials for the guys for doing the works and I also do a bit of design work for all the different work that we get in. Since I've started here, there's been quite a few projects I've been involved in that have, have been very proud in how they work and they're still working to this day, they're still in production. I'm Jack Spark and I'm a second year apprentice. I do like welding, do fabrication, pipe fitting, every day it's different. You're doing work that you're proud of, just learning every day really, it's good. There's a good future in it as well, you know, you can go anywhere once your time's served. My name is Miguel Gomez, I'm an electrician to trade and I'm also a director of McDonald & Monroe. Although I'm, I'm office based, I'm still out on site showing guys what, what works has been priced and what works we're wanting them to do, helping out if, if there's any issues or problems. I do various work from bathroom suites, heating systems, then I'm on the roof doing the lead work, copper sheet work on the roofs. It's never the same thing every day. Well, there's that many different trades, so you could try them all. I know there's schemes that you can do to try a bit of everything, and you'll find one. And the camaraderie with everybody working in a team is really good. There's a lot of work out there, and we find that uh, there's not enough kids leaving school and going into trades. You'll never stick for work. You always need plumbers, always need electricians. If you're any good at your job, you'll always be busy. I've always wanted to be an electrician. My dad's an electrician as well, so that's why. I was out working with him from like the age of five, probably, and left school and joined McDonald's. Being female in this industry is not any different to being a male. It doesn't matter that I'm a girl and working with all the boys and stuff, it's a good crack. It's kind of like one big family here, to be honest. <laughs> so yeah, go for it. <laughs>